This is problem number five for section 3.1. In this problem it says find the slope of the function's graph at the given point, then find an equation for the line tangent to the graph there. So we want to start by finding the slope, then we want to find the line that's tangent uh, to that graph at this point, to this function at this point. So we're going to start by finding the slope expression. And I'm going to say that that is equal to the limit as h approaches 0 of f of x plus h minus f of x all over h. So let's start by taking this function and plugging in x plus h. And we end up with the limit as h approaches 0 of negative 2 x plus h cubed minus uh, negative 2x cubed. And that's all over h. The first thing I need to do is I need to go through and figure out what is x plus h cubed. Well, that's x plus h times x plus h times x plus h which equals x squared plus, when you do x times h and then uh, h times x, that's 2xh plus h squared h times h. And that's multiplied still by x plus h. Now we take x squared times x, that's x cubed. x squared times h, that's plus x squared h plus 2xh times x is 2x squared h plus 2xh times h is 2xh squared. h squared times x is plus h squared x. And then h squared times h is plus h cubed. So that's x cubed plus 3x squared h plus 3xh squared plus h cubed. So I can take this and plug it in and replace the x plus h cubed. And so it's going to give me limit as h approaches 0, negative 2 parentheses x cubed plus 3x squared h plus 3xh squared plus h cubed and then I'll get plus 2x cubed when we distribute the negative there. That's all over h. Let's go ahead and distribute then. We have limit as h approaches 0, negative 2x cubed minus 6x squared h minus 6xh squared minus 2h cubed plus 2x cubed all over h. And don't forget our goal is to cancel this h out because when we take the limit as h approaches 0, that gives us something undefined. We can cancel the 2x cubes. And let's factor out an h at the same time. Now we've canceled those, so we can factor an h out of the top and we'll get limit as h approaches 0 of h. This will give you negative 6x squared minus 6xh minus 2h squared all over h. We can cancel the h's. And we have limit as h approaches 0, negative 6x squared minus 6xh minus 2h squared. When we plug in h of 0, this is going to cancel that term and that term, so we're left with negative 6x squared. This is the expression for our slope for any point on this line here. Now, we need to go through and we need to find the slope at 2, negative 16. So that means we're going to say that that's going to be negative 6. 2 squared, which is negative 24. 
So that's the slope at this point on this line. Now I want to find the tangent line. So to find the tangent line, I take this and plug it into slope intercept form. When I plug in 2 and negative 16, I get negative 16 equals negative 24 times 2 plus b. So negative 16 equals negative 48 plus b. When I add this over, I get 32 is b. So the equation is y equals negative 24x plus 32. Now I do want to point out that I should probably be using a t here instead of an x. We kind of went through and we were using x's this whole time. I should rewrite this with the t because the original function has t, so we should say that that's y equals negative 24t plus 32.